Depression came on the oil discovery in 1928. That was a big thing. I was in London at the time, and uh, the office wired me that they'd struck uh, 40, 40 million feet of gas out here, and, and I said to my wife, well, uh, there's no radio in Oklahoma City. We've got to have a radio. We lose money on it. But uh, I wired to Mr. Bell, our manager, to go and buy WKY because I knew we'd have an oil field in Oklahoma City. And that's, uh, of course, I knew we'd lose money on it, which we did for a couple of years because you started, you had a radio station. Nobody had any uh, radio stations. <laughs> Same thing happened in 1948 when we started, we, we filed an application for a television station in Oklahoma City. Nobody else had filed for one. There were very few around the country, and they, they'd been begging people to fly, apply for a television permit. We applied for one. We knew we'd lose money on it because nobody could receive it if you put on a program. But in 1948, we got the, well, I'd expect it to take at least 90 days red tape up there in Washington, but we got it back almost by return mail.